Hello dear viewers of Turkmen Voice channel, I'm glad to see you again. Today's video will be about the incidents that happened recently in Turkmenistan uh, a few days back on June 4th. By the way, it happened in Lebap region where I lived before. And uh, that incident happened between the police officer and the uh, driver. Police officer stopped the car for traffic violation and that police officer gave to the driver option either the police officer give the ticket to that driver for that violation or driver can dismiss that ticket by giving certain amount of money to the police officer for that type of request the driver refused it and not only refused he start to videotape him the driver start to record the video of that incident and uh, police officer he get angry and he took his badge from his shoulder and ripped that off that badge and immediately accused the driver and as well as the passengers that those people attacked him and ripped that rip off his badge from his shoulder and you can watch the video right now <laughs> And now, after watching this video, you might thinking, Akmarat, everything here obvious. I saw with my own eyes how the police officer took that badge with his own hand and ripped that off. There was no any attacks. Yeah, I agree with you. On video, or everything visible. We can see police officer took that badge himself, ripped it off, then falsely accused the driver that they attack him. But in Turkmenistan, everything happened opposite. Everything will be opposite. Guilty will be free and not guilty. Innocent person will be in jail, will be in prison. Same thing happened here. Do you believe that? The, the police officer, he's not guilty, he's still working. But the driver, as well as the passengers also, guys, innocent passengers and driver, innocent driver. He, they, all of them were imprisoned, guys. Imprisoned. Do you believe that? For just videotaping, you imprisoned. For just videotaping, imagine, guys. And... They will be questioned why that government doing this? Why the government not pleading that guy, that the police officer guilty and uh, not telling that uh, driver is bravo, you did good, you showed your power, you recorded it, you showed us the criminal. Why the police, why the government not, uh, not rewarding the driver for that action and why government not punishing the police officer for this type of violation? Answer is easy. Because government trying to kill, trying to kill 
your internal spirit, your brave spirit to fight against this dictatorial regime. They want to let you be full obedient servant who going to just do whatever they say, who will not have any rights, who will who, who shouldn't even open their mouth, who should agree for all the laws which will come down from one person, from one family, Berd Muhammadov, the father Gurbangoli Berd Muhammadov and his son Serdar Berd Muhammadov. The government trying to just shut your mouth. And if that government, if president will order to imprison that guy, that police officer, do, do you know what's going to happen? The Turkmenistanian people will feel free. They will start to record that video. They will start to record the video for all the police officers. They will start to record all the police officers for any traffic violations. I mean, like for any type of uh, criminal actions from the police officers when they was asking the money. But no, no, no. Now Turkmenistan trying to put the fear, trying to put the fear in the heart of the people to not let them even take their phone out of their pocket. By showing that if you take your phone out, try to record, they're going to imprison you as that guy was imprisoned, as that driver was imprisoned. This is what shocking news, guys, and you saw the video. And only... If I will ask you to share this video, to spread this video, show this video to everybody. I hope all police officers will hear about the situations in Turkmenistan and they will at least fear us instead of fearing the government. They will fear us by the thinking, by thinking that this, if they're going to take the money, if they're going to take if they're going to ask the money from driver, their faces, their video also will be spread out in the social media at least this type of fear we have to put in their heart because they don't have any fear from the uh, from the authorities because authority are supporting the police officers to punish the people badly punish the people without any 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 mercy thank you guys for watching this video and i really appreciate for subscribing and supporting my channel please leave your comments and uh, again, I will never, uh, uh, I will never be tired to tell that we will achieve democracy in Turkmenistan just by working together. We need to be united, and uh, it's slow process, but we will do it. We shouldn't, we shouldn't stop. Despite uh, those attacks, despite uh, threats for your family members we should keep going for our future young generation to give them freedom we need to give them freedom because the young generation young innocent kids they don't know yet where they born and what is awaiting them in the future they don't know and we need to fight for them for their future because they are not conscious yet thank you guys for supporting my channel see you next time